Good afternoon, my name is Hesan Kim, advisor of Gangnam Labor Law Firm. Today, uh, we will discuss with the labor attorney Jung Bong Su about the workforce, particular case of workforce uh, harassment. So, could you explain the background of the story? Uh, hello, uh, how are you today? Uh, this is uh, Bong Su Jung, Korean labor attorney. Today, I'd like to introduce one case uh, that is related to the work place harassment. So this is uh, some little bit different because uh, uh, labor inspector um, they informed the company. Uh, I mean, the case started uh, in May when the uh, employee uh, with a disability quit his job uh, because of workplace harassment and he made a detailed report about how uh, he was uh, uh, harassed by his uh, superiors. Uh, also the company's uh, working environment. So, uh, according to the, his uh, explanation, um, some he is uh, about 27 year old, uh, the young man, and little old uh, senior workers, uh, especially female workers, uh, harassed him, calling him um, like uh, um, very negative word, uh, like uh, here in Korean, like uh, 개새끼 or 저새끼, something. It's a kind of son of a bitch in English. Uh, also, uh, they harassed uh, him, uh, like uh, demoting his character, uh, also humiliating him. Uh, for, so he reported uh, this uh, workplace harassment to his um, uh, general manager, then general manager um, uh, warned them not to repeat such a harassment, but uh, a few uh, time later uh, they repeated. Uh, also the his team, lead, team leader. So when he, uh, one day, uh, he arrived uh, uh, in the company and uh, explained to the manager, uh, uh, like a team leader, uh, he's uh, so sick, he could not work. Then uh, his um, uh, team leader told uh, him, uh, why you didn't, why you come to the company in such a uh, not good uh, uh, the health problem. So he just said one comment, so his uh, intention was uh, you, you could not come just uh, informed by telephone, it should be enough, then why you come? But this um, uh, employee with a disability, big employee with disability, thought uh, his kind of uh, harassing, like uh, he's uh, uh, not uh, smart enough to say like that. So uh, he thought he was uh, humiliated by his uh, uh, team leader's remark. So because of that, uh, he decided not to come to the work and made a report and report it to the uh, labor office. So then labor office uh, uh, sent uh, some documentation for correcting uh, some uh, workplace harassment. So the company president uh, uh, accept the, the accepted, I mean they uh, received uh, such a uh, government uh, correction order from especially uh, labor ministry. So uh, they then uh, this company president uh, um, had the HR manager investigate the case and uh, they made a report uh, that uh, they investigated the each the person uh, and uh, the company tried to warn them not to repeat. So some of them uh, violated. Uh, also, it was a, a kind of workplace harassment. So th he, uh, company president made a report. So also she said uh, she'll do best not to repeat such a thing. Then the such a uh, the report for correction uh, uh, to the labor office. Then labor inspector reviewed that uh, the content for the correction order. Um, then uh, the labor inspector thought it is not enough. So also a company did not. Uh, the follow the follow up action required by this uh, um, the workplace harassment uh, section in the labor standard act. So um, the labor inspector uh, uh, give a second order for correcting this uh, workplace harassment. So the, uh, 
they so this uh, company president uh, had to supplement more uh, detailed uh, the uh, disciplinary action for this one. So he asked some legal advice to me. So I reviewed the case and I told him uh, what what the law is like uh, according to the article uh, 73, uh, 70, uh, 76-3 of the labor stand. It explained how employee take a right procedure uh, when there is a report uh, report for workplace harassment. So, uh, in what they missed is uh, uh, the, the investigation process was not appropriate. Uh, also, uh, it was uh, very subjective. Uh, also, report was uh, uh, so companies measure for this uh, after they investigating case. This case, uh, just company president uh, warned all those late people not repeat. But there are no. Uh, correction. So uh, my advice is, uh, you have to uh, the, uh, the investigate the case. Uh, even uh, some you have to investigate the witnesses who were involved with this case. Then you have to know exact fact. Uh, then uh, also based on fact, company should give a disciplinary action. So comp what the company missed uh, in this report was. Uh, uh, there are no different actions, so um, this, uh, the employee with a disability uh, quit his uh, job because of workplace harassment, then the follow-up action must be strict and company should have uh, the, uh, punished those people related with this uh, uh, the workplace uh, harassment. Yeah. Mm. I see, so the company uh, report was not accepted by the labor mm -hmm. office because of the lack of uh, mm -hmm. proof yeah. or subjective uh, mm. uh, finding. Yeah. So if we, it is regrettable because if uh, our labor office, uh, I mean uh, labor reform can be involved and uh, gave the proper advice, mm -hmm. then the, they may be accepted mm -hmm. in the labor office. So mm -hmm. um, do you think uh, uh, I following your advice, they mm. will correct and uh, you will uh, advise. Yeah, so I advise them with uh, some my some document we uh, the, uh, prepared last time for the other case. Uh, also, I advise that this uh, president of this company, uh, company should take uh, appropriate uh, the follow action for uh, correcting or. Uh, some preventing this workplace harassment, that is uh, some punishing those people related to the workplace harassment. I see. Thank you very much for your comment. Okay, thank you for watching. Okay, bye-bye.